and welcome to my playhouse. Today I'm still in the winter garden and I'm having problems with my lawnmower. So if you are thinking, oh no, not another lawnmower movie on YouTube, you're probably the only one because I haven't seen that many. Um, but I just mowed the lawn and uh, I have a defective wheel on the lawnmower. It's like wiggly and I've actually had the wheel fall off on the lawnmower. Um, I fixed it last year. I went to a shop and bought two new bearings and they were about $10 for two bearings. It wasn't that bad. And this year the wheel almost fell off again. I was a, a bit more uh, caution about it so I actually saw the problem before the wheel fell off but it was still bad and I took off the wheel and I went to the same place to get new bearings and the place was closed. Uh, it was just closed for the weekend but I didn't get the bearing that I wanted so I went on the internet and searched for the bearings for the for the lawnmower and I found some in China and they weren't exactly cheaper than the 10 bucks I paid last year but see what I got yeah I, I got a whole stack of bearings and they weren't that expensive and it was like free shipping shipping and it's not the only thing because I got another one <clears throat> I got 20 bearings for the lawnmower and even though these were more expensive, the entire thing, I wasn't able to buy three or four or five. I could only buy 20 if I wanted a reasonable price. I paid about $30 for these 20 bearings and now I need two. So I don't know, these probably won't break in, in the time that the lawnmower lives now I definitely got enough and free shipping and it took about a month for them to be delivered so it would have been cheaper and faster to go down to the local shop and buy two for the wheel that failed this year I am a bit harsh <coughs> hard on the lawnmower uh, cut under the bushes and stuff like that so let's change the bearings this is my lawnmower and it's it's four years old I think and it's pretty uh, pretty cheap lawnmower which might be why it's it, it is failing and I think this is the wheel that is bad yeah that's not good Gonna take off this plastic cap. Yeah, it is pretty. It's pretty easy to see what the problem is. I have a plastic container that I'm gonna put under the lawnmower. Like that. Yeah, this is absolutely <laughs> wasted. And I need to get this one off. And they are usually pretty difficult. I have a hairpin and a screwdriver. And I'm gonna see if I can get this off without losing it. I don't have an extra. And I got it. I'll save this somewhere. Put this somewhere safe. Like right there 
top of the cap. And <clears throat> let's just say that the wheel came right off and all the <laughs> bearing bolts. <laughs> Yeah, it's absolutely worthless. The bearings are so dead. Before I do anything more, I want to check if the bearing fits on this. Because if that's not the case, this fixes not gonna work. And they do. And pretty snug. Snugly too. Cool. That's gonna be perfect. I hope. Here is one bearing. Most of the iron balls has come out of it. That's no good. The other one is a little bit better, but only a little bit. This is still hanging together, so it's a little bit better, but it's still broken. So this is a self-driving lawnmower, so it it drives. A, it it I don't have to push it; it goes by itself. Uh, so there is like, yeah. These teeth goes on those teeth and this turns around and that makes the wheel go around. So to mount the these bearings they have a they have a mounting bracket or something like that to to make sure that they don't go inside of the wheel. And they fit right in there, like this. And the other one on the other side, like that. And the wheel is ready to go back on place. I put on this uh, thing last time because the wheel was so wobbly. Put that on. I need this one. ring goes back on and I'm gonna use the I'm gonna use the hairpin again to make sure that I don't lose it And the lawnmower is fixed. <laughs> uh, 
And I'm just gonna check the other wheel. Say hello, kitty. Hmm. I guess she's camera shy. I'm gonna check these as well, see if they are still good. They still look pretty good, but when I have 20 of the other ones, I rather want, I rather want to put them, those in. They really feel like a lot better quality, quality than these. I'm going to put the new ones in. I'm going to put this one on together with this little one that is there already. I'm going to change the, the positions. So this one is inside and put this one. And put this one on the outside. There we are. And this one has another type of locking brackets. I guess I, I think I broke one last year when I changed it. So I had to put on another one. Another tool to put this one on. And I have to be very careful that I don't lose it. That's one hell of a difference. This wheel is a lot better on it right now. So with the kitty eating and the water from the basement filling out into the fish tank, pond, and the lawnmower back on, back in duty, back in order, with the wheel, both wheels securely fastened, everything is good again. That was my easy fix to the lawnmower. I went on the internet at adxbus.com and I found these bearings 
that's the one for my model of lawnmower. They probably won't fit on yours, but uh, search around and you might find some bearings that is good for your lawnmower. And I have better time to feed the cat. And thank you for watching my videos. Do subscribe to my channel so that you can see me again. Have a really nice day. Bye bye. Kitty. Kitty. She's a star. She knows she's a celebrity. Kitty movies on YouTube. They're so famous. But, yeah. To be a star, you have to look in the camera, kitty. Kitty.